you guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today we're going to be making my lunch for tomorrow for my friday so yeah please excuse the mess i had so many technical difficulties today this was just like a last minute thing and i wasn't expecting to film so yeah so the first thing that i did was just wash my container because i used it the previous day and today and i just wanted to make sure that it's clean and not dirty because uh, that would be gross. I'm just rinsing it with water first, and then to get hopefully get all that food off, and then I um, wipe it down with a sponge and some soap. And I do want to say on the weekends I do put it in like the um, washing machine or the machine and stuff. So yeah, like I said, this video was so rushed that you could see the um that i was using a juice bottle to hold my phone up while i was cleaning my container because it was a hot mess so yeah so i know it's only been like a few weeks but comment down below if there's any ideas you guys want to see me do um because I'd sure love, like, any ideas. So, yeah. Um, oh, and I went to go get a paper towel because I prefer wash wiping it down with just a paper towel. Um, so yeah. Okay, so after washing everything, I took you guys to the counter, and I'm just getting out my fruits and vegetables, because basically how I pack my lunch is that I use my two two compartments, this two small compartments. I put a vegetable or a fruit or two vegetables or two fruits, depending on the day. So today I picked strawberries and grapes. And then in the third compartment, I normally do a chip component. And I'm a mess. Yeah. Like I said, there's a big mess, but it works. And here, I'm trying to figure out where to put you guys. So, yeah. We chose to sit you guys on an oil bottle because it was the most dirty and it you guys had the best view. I take all the grapes off the stems because I feel that you can fit a few more in there that way and it reduces the amount of trash that I bring to school. I'm trying to pack as many as I can in there because Okay, now with the strawberries. I decided to cut my strawberries. Like I said, this was like right after dinner. So it was very... It was... Still had the dinner mess. I'm cutting them. I decided to cut them into... I think... Just smaller triangles, so I cut them in half and then cut them into those halves into halves. So I think fourths. I'm not exactly sure because I wasn't like making sure that they were all the same, but um, and before any of you guys are wondering, I got my lunch container from Justice. 
this was like last year they had a sale or something and I got it and I'm still using it because I like it getting a little bit of cling wrap because I wear like um clean wrap because sometimes my strawberries leak in the container um so just to be safe I put them in a the little plastic wrap um then I struggled with it because I didn't make the piece big enough yeah today it's just it was a whole lot of struggling yeah and I'm like I'm not sure how I even did it but I did it and I put them in the container I got it it's like probably not even secure but I got it and it looks very nice next thing is I went to go get my chip um we have a few options of chips on hand but today I chose Pringles, I believe. Yep, just classic original Pringles. I put a small stack in them, and then I see how many fit, and if I put too many, then I put either put them back in the jar or I eat them. Okay, here I believe I'm getting the things to make my sandwich. So I put a sandwich in the logic compartment. Because I prefer sandwiches because they like, they're nice for a long day. Yep, we're at the very land of the loaf. But, um, yeah, and I literally finished my jar of peanut butter yesterday. So y'all got to see a new one. And please don't worry, um, I know that my, uh, bread is on the counter, but I wiped it off before this video, and I also don't mind, because everything that goes on the counter, the majority of it I'm eating, so. Yeah. Um, and I spread my peanut butter weird. I use the back of the spoon, because I find it's way easier. Um, and I put way too much. So I put a little bit on the other bread, piece of bread, but then I finish spreading it out. And spread out the other side. Smacked it together. I got a knife and I just cut it in half. It's not perfect, but I'm not really measuring it. And then at this point, I realized that something was like missing. So I went to go grab like a dessert or something and I found a brownie that we had and I just cut it in half so it would fit in my container. I set it right in front of my sandwich for a nice sweet treat and stuff. Which is nice. I believe it's like a store bought brownie. I wiped my lid down with a pa another paper towel just to make sure it is um, dry because sometimes the crevices are harder to get Then I put the lid on, snapped it in place, adding, wiping it off again, 
adding a little pressure to the corners and I put it in the fridge and this might be the most boring part but right now we have to clean up so I'm putting the strawberries and the grapes back in the um, fridge where I found them Put my peanut butter away. Now the bread just had the two ends left, so I just threw the bread away. And like napkins and the peanut butter lid and stuff. My grape. Putting my spoon away and. Taking a bite of strawberry because don't want to waste it. Put it in the trash. All done. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you guys next time. And bye.